Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Subscriber Replays, Ace vs. Ace. And today we have Opium and Big Smoke. Opium is in his M12 and Big Smoke is in the Type 64, the little premium light tank at Tier 6. And they are in a Tier 10 game, so if they get damage done and spotted, spotting damage for uh, Big Smoke, they're going to come out of here with quite the profit and XP gain. First up, Big Smoke is going to this spot and spots every single tank going up the hill. This is a very, very good spot to go if you're a scout. And we're going to switch to Opium in the M12 as he is going to take a shot on the driving uphill KV4. Very slow, so you can take some shots on those guys as they are not climbing the hill very fast so um, and they want to climb the hill so you don't have to uh, like predict their movement except for them going forward as this KD4 he didn't stop once at all climbing the hill takes a shot on the T69 maybe he's spotted maybe he's not no shells flying his way so far breaks a little cover there they also have another platoon mate, which is in an FCM, but no replay from him, as he is not part of the ace versus ace. He is going to be down there and shoot a little bit at the First enemy tanks. Blood. A chaffy, a little annoying chaffy. He's going to be annoying later, so um, he's going to be let go right there. He's just going to try and run as far away as possible. And we're going to look at the M12 view again. He has plenty of tanks to shoot at. He should just shoot it right there, in my opinion. He could have shot or hit something. But he's going for the uh, the VK, hoping for him to stop at some point. And he fires, but it is way too short. There's a small hill there, if I remember correctly. Back to Big Smoke, as the Chaffee is now... Down here, oh, he can see him, so he's been spotted from somewhere. He's going to take a quick shot here. On the move, oh, Type 59 is shooting down on him, so he has to move his tank. Type gets hit, though, from something, so he has other things to deal with, which is very good. That leaves Big Smoke to do whatever he wants. And he's just going to go back a little bit, retreat, and go and sit in a bush right here. Try and get some spots off from this position instead. Activate those binoculars. And just sit here and look a little bit. <laughs> While he's just looking here and the M12 Ophium is going to shoot the um, enemy tank in just a second, I'm going to explain that there are many people who have sent in Ace versus Ace tanker um, games. And I've seen... I've seen all the emails, but I, I, I just can't feature all of them uh, within a very short amount of time. So I do know about a lot of the um, the Ace versus Ace replays that have been sent in. So don't worry, I have seen them and they are highly likely going to be featured. Highly likely. Um, I like this format, the uh, going back and forward from two views. So um, if you just... Send them in, I will see them. You have Big Smoke trying to go up against the T30, but he's going to bounce on the side because the T or the Type 624 just doesn't have that penetration. Opium 2000, you're going to hit the Yak Tiga in the side. Not a lot of damage there. The T30 is looking this way, so Big Smoke can't just go up there and shoot at the Yak Tiga. T30 is still looking this way. And ouch. Gets hit in the back by a Rheinmetall Borsig Waffenträger. And he has to retreat. But something else is shooting at him. And that is the Chaffee. As we can see here, he gets tracked by it. While he's being chased by the Chaffee, Ophium is going to take a shot at the T30 and kill him. And back to Big Smoke as we see him getting away and just out of harm's way. He couldn't see the Chaffee. So the Chaffee was taking some blind shots like outside of render range so he was lucky that he didn't get hit anywhere special you can see that he shoots pretty close to him so he must have just disappeared as the chaffee took that last shot chaffee gets behind some cover 
and Big Smoke is just waiting for him now. But the Chaffee isn't, sadly, isn't that stupid. And while we're just looking at Big Smoke, um, Ophium is missing his arty shells, so we're not missing anything important. Hits him twice, the Waffenträger, and then the Chaffee gets into the open, and that is his downfall. Boom. Annoying little dude is down. Big Smoke is going to hit this tank three times. One, two, and then one more. But we're going to switch to Ophium as he is hitting the E3 up here, tier 10. He's going to be quite the problem. But this platoon has them covered. The ISU takes out their third platoon mate, AFTS, in the FCM 50 ton. And Big Smoke is going to move up here and just sit in some bushes and do what he does best, scout. <laughs> Something funny is coming up right here. He's going to penetrate. Pew! Right there. Where did that shell hit? Where did he hit that tank so he could penetrate it that easily? Ovium does hit him with the arty there for 250 damage. But then it disappears, and Ophium has to reload as the ISU is spotted down there. IS-3, Line Metal is going to shoot at it. Sets it on fire. Can he get the kill? He could. And he avenged his fallen teammate by killing the tank that killed him. Nice. You see here, Big Smoke is going to move up. Activate the binoculars and spot the E3. Right there, they activated, and Ophium is already on target. And he's gonna fire a shell. Oh, move, move. Oh, he moves just enough forward to get tracked. And then Big Smoke is gonna put a lot of damage into him. This little scout can punch out some damage pretty fast if you're not careful. E3 moves forward and is out of harm's way in just a second. No, he gets, he gets hit one more time. And there we go. Turns his armor and that is it. No more penetrations for Big Smoke. So far it looks pretty grim. Um, except they have an arty in Ophium. And Ophium, um, um, un, n, ends with an N. Um, there we go, yeah. <laughs> and all they need to do is spot the E3, and then you can get a shot at it. Activates the binoculars again, and he spots him right there. He's not moving fast enough, and Ophion gets the shot on him there. So it's a level playing field now. Tier 8s versus Tier 8s. And a few 7s. And a 6. There, Artie takes out the IS-3, the allied team. Artie is in some kind of dip, so Big Smoke could not get a shot on him. But he is going to move around and go straight for it. We know that the Waffenträger is down by the houses. Don't know what he's doing right now, though. As they are trying to cap with the AT-15. There's the Artie. Will Big Smoke hit it? Missed. Hit again. There we go. Yak Panda takes it out. And now, wee! A little slidey slide there. Very nice. And it's gonna get acknowledged by the KV4. Who's dead? The Allied team. There we go. He's gonna go around and flank and see if he can find the IS 3 hiding over here somewhere. Maybe, 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 maybe not, maybe, maybe. But what I didn't expect was the ice 3 to just go through the middle of the field to spot the AT-15. Ophian misses the shot. IS-3 bounces on the butt, then turns his tank. So Big Smoke can actually penetrate him. And he does. Silly ice 3 Silly. If he had just kept his uh, tank 
you know, angled, he wouldn't have been penetrated by him, but he didn't know what kind of tank it was that hit him. Could have been a, a G shell. He is going to sit still right here, just to aim at the AT-15. That's going to be a big mistake with Artie in the air. And now we're going to see here, Big Smoke, can he hit that little weak spot? There we go, right in the side. And takes out the IS-3. Very, very nice. Now there's only the Heimatel Borsig Waffenträger left. And... He's gonna go. Did you understand that? I didn't. He's just gonna cross the field, go straight for him, hoping he's just sitting in the house. But no, he is going for the decap, and he's gonna turn quickly and shoot big smoke. And at the same time, Ovian kills him. Just look at this. Pew, pew. Immediately, at the same time, almost the shells came flying. But yeah, that was Ace Tanker for Ovian. So we see here 2,094 XP and bonus credits for an event. That was 50,000 credits. He hit less than 50% of his shells. And then we have Big Smoke, 5,060 XP. And those credits are earned all by him. He gets patrol duty as well. He did almost 6,000 spawning damage, almost 2,000 damage, and here is the final standing. We have Big Smoke on top of Ophium. It was a good ace versus ace. Thank you for sending that one in. I'll see you guys next time.